Hi everybody, welcome back to another video, and today I'm going to show you how to create a shop in Flow Lab. So if I press play on this game, and so I only have a couple punches, like look, I only have 14 punches, and when I press this, I can't buy it. But when, let me just get um the amount, but let's just say, when I get like 50 punches, I can buy it, and it minus is 50 from my account. So that's basically going to show you how to do, and um, it's fairly simple. <coughs> so first, what you want is so first, if you're doing a um clicker game, obviously you want to mouse click, mouse click number plus, and then out value for um your label. But what you say, but let's see. So say. So, ah, sorry. So this is your ma so you're going to need. Sorry, okay. Guys, okay. So whatever your amount, like, say, look, the number that shows for the plus, like when you have the, okay, the code that um that basically adds and gives you whatever currency you want you want to you, you need that it's going to be very important but first so you want to make the thing that you would like to have once they click the item and have the correct amount of points so i did a little animation beard thing for um saitama from one punch man and so basically what it, so basically what you do is you get your block, okay? You get your block here, and you do the just mouse click, okay? And that's all you have to do, and then put like a letter, okay? And so then you go to behaviors, and for your main box, you have out. So what you want to do is you want to have a switch, and you want to put this out into the switch, and you want to put it in, okay? So I, so the, so what you want to do is after that you want to get um your your like add the code to add stuff and you also want to make a filter um you, yeah you want to make two filters okay so for this filter so I would have so you want to be so which ever the amount of like points you want minus that by one and make it greater than for this filter and then for this in filter value you want to have less than 50. so basically what the so with your switch you want to put you want to put connect this number like you're adding into the in and then you want to have pass and you want to turn the switch on and and you want to get the thing that like you want to create or add to the character and you just want to like start that okay and but and you but if anyone did this so the, if anyone did this they really no so if they have greater than 50 if you just like left it alone by this then they would have the same amount of like points except they but they, they wouldn't have it subtracted and there's nothing stopping them from just from just pressing it and then and then like getting the item so basically with this filter so you want to put out and in again and you want to have with the pass so you want to put pass and you want to put this off because this makes that if they have less than the amount of points you want, then they do not, then they're not able to start the, your character animation. Okay? Anyway, so after that, <coughs> well, actually, to be honest, this is basically it. It just takes a lot of filters and switches. And so with this number here, okay you just want to have you just want to put this out in the plus symbol and 
just put out and put it into whatever your, your code is to like add the points and put in the plus symbol. And to be honest, that's basically it. I really hope you guys enjoyed and remember to share this to all your friends who are also in trouble and goodbye.